no puede hacerlo. Eh, Mica. Oh, genial. Da la bomba, Mica. Bomba, Mica. What's up guys, I'm heading to Minka, and, uh, which is a beautiful place and I'm heading with Beladies. If you, if you don't know who Beladies is, she was in my last video where I went to Soledad and I was hanging out with a whole family of people and we decided she was going to be my tour guide, okay? <laughs> Alright, before you think anything, she is just my friend, mi amiga, okay? And she's just going to be showing me around, alright? For those who don't know what Mika is, Mika is a, a beautiful town that has a lot of waterfalls, a lot of farms and everything. It's a beautiful area and it's outside of Santa Marta, so I wanted to go there. I wanted to go on an adventure and I'm taking you guys with me. We're going to be there or in the area for a couple of days. And so I can't wait to show you what happens next. But uh, today we're going to go to a very cool um hotel that has spectacular views and i can't wait to show you that but it's going to be an adventure just to get there itself all right yo hey, Mika. ¿Qué piensas de ese lugar? it's beautiful amazing uh, tranquilo mm -hmm. uh, mucho más frío que acá. ah okay so all right cool i brought my sweater all right so she basically said it's beautiful it's amazing and it's uh, more colder than it is here so can't wait to find out guys so we're gonna recap when we get to the city of Santa Marta uh, for the next step you got to do to get to Minka guys it's a beautiful day here this is one of the towns you go through when you're here this is Cienega? Cienega Magdalena Magdalena this is Cienega Magdalena I can't even say it like she no puede ser este como ella Pero es el una ciudad antes de Santa Marta. Sí. Un pueblo o una ciudad. Municipio. It's like a, a town or something like that, and it's before you get to um, Santa Marta. Check it out. I was just commenting to her. It was like a perfect day. The weather is good. We were supposed to come yesterday, but I'm glad she forced me to wait for her. Okay, so yeah. We'll, it's good man check it out guys if you were planning on taking this trip just expect to for the bus to stop a couple times so you have a couple options you can take a, a private car from wherever you're coming from let's say you're coming from cartagena this is just the most economical one right you're going to be dealing with all type of people uh, getting off the bus and coming back on the bus i just wanted to notate the closer you get to santa marta the more you're going to see these amazing hills it's really cool and uh supposedly we should be dealing with that when we get where we're going it's going to be a lot of hills all right guys so we are in santa marta i need to pick up my bags i don't even know where i put my receipt Shout out to my camera girl. We linked up with our other uh, cousin right here, the guy that was with us at the party. And now we're gonna head to uh, the taxi, and these guys are gonna be helping me figure out how to get there. We, I don't, I have no idea. All right, guys. So uh, the ride is gonna be fifty-five thousand pesos. So whatever that is, when you come here, as soon as you get to the end, the taxi driver can bring you. So let's go. Uh, this is just one leg of the trip. There's more to it. So. <laughs> Pay attention, don't skip. Bueno, listo. Yo le, yo le digo. We're almost on our way to Minka. They said it would be around a 40 minute drive. Um, I'm testing my wind uh, reduction. I got a little rig on the, um, the GoPro, so hopefully it doesn't make too much noise. But uh, yeah, this is what we're going through right now. Normally it'll be a 40 minute drive, but from what I'm hearing, the guy, the taxi driver, saying with some traffic, if you just, you're gonna have a lot of traffic, it's gonna be a little bit longer. 
So keep that in mind. Uh, we hit our first, what might be our first roll bump. The car is overheating going through these hills. As literally, uh, my ears are popping because we're going higher and higher. And uh, this guy's telling me the car is overheating, as you can see. Okay. <laughs> so make sure if you are going to get in a taxi, make sure you get in a good one. <laughs> okay. So this was a draw of luck. Hopefully, we don't have to stop, but man, that needle is getting real close. <laughs> Alright guys, we're almost there. Thank God. I thought we were gonna be stuck on the road, but we're clear. We're almost there. All these big bamboo trees here. I feel like I'm in Guatape, but we're not. But I'm so happy we're here. Very natural area. This is the town, I guess. It looks like the town. I said the Pueblo. Yeah, oh, okay. So this is the town guys. Alright. And there's smoke coming from the hood. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. So we're gonna be staying in two different locations. First day we're gonna be staying at a location where this has amazing views but there's no Wi-Fi. And another place is gonna be real cool and really close to the waterfall. <laughs> No, hay uh, jeep. Jeep. Un no, jeep. Arriba, eso es moto. No hay. No hay. No, moto. Ah, es moto. Este que agarra maleta. They normally have jeeps, but they don't have one available. So we're gonna, in order for us to see, keep going, we're gonna need to go through a motorcycle. Because I got a bag that big, I'm gonna need to have a moto, uh, a part there, separate moto. ¿Cuánto es? Okay, so it's 20,000 pesos to go up. For me, it's gonna be 40,000 pesos because I have a bag and it's gonna be two people. So this is a town of Minka. It doesn't seem as big as I thought it would be. Um, very beautiful though. Uh, you can hear music playing in the background and um, different um, scenery here. You do see some expat here. Well, I'm not gonna say expat, you're gonna see, I don't know who lives here for sure, but it does look like there's backpackers here. One indication is uh, just the clothes people are wearing here. You can tell a little bit, but uh, really nice, really nice. But we're gonna be going further up. There probably is some hostels and accommodations here to stay in, but we're going further up to check out the scenery. The new rules is you have to take your temperature before you can go up. So they're gonna be taking our temperature right now. No, está bien. I made a big mistake. I should have let these guys uh, handle it. The, the negotiation, I came out talking wrong. But so if you do this, don't do it. If you know some locals, let them do the talking. <laughs> no problem, let's do it. So, yeah, this is what we wanted to get in one of those, but uh, they didn't have them available apparently. But tomorrow we might because we're gonna be going from one place to the next. Let's uh, do a quick look of this place right here. I got a barber shop right here, got the styles popping right here. Nice, right, so a little facial. If you need the facial done in the in the in the town area, Lisa, let's go. Okay, I hear some water. Ah, oh, you can see water right there. I'm ready. See. Yo, <laughs> yo. We're not gonna do another um, bike because she actually fits on it. So we'll just be doing three bikes instead of four bikes. But check this out guys, little water area here. So we came just to um, be in this water. Water looks really good guys. Oh, I can't wait, I can't wait. Okay, amigo, para buscarte una más grande, por. Eh, no caben. Ah, sí, sí. Ok. para ti. Oh. <laughs> oh, they, they said they didn't get a bigger bike and I was like what she don't fit they're like no we need a bigger bike for me 
Ah, eso. <laughs> Come on, man. Come get the big boy. All right, we try to do the Jeep with y'all. Y'all ain't want to get it in. Okay, this bike. Okay, we can see. This is a lot bigger. Go bigger. Okay, well. All right, guys. <laughs> Necesito gasolina. <laughs> so we're going to get some gasoline, guys. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> this is the trip. Es un buena ciudad, yo te gusta. Un pueblo. Sí, un pueblo. Ajá. Ajá. Hay una escuela todo aquí. Sí, señor. They got school here and everything, you yeah, guys. All right. My boy about to get some gas. Okay. Salud, todo el mundo. We're going to be like, who's this guy? So this is how you get gas guys they normally these stores these little restaurants or everything they'll have like gasoline on the cut just to fill up Okay, and then you have a uh, like a hardware store over here. Let's look at the hardware store Okay Nice little hardware store uh, for uh, to change size and stuff like that little cafe right here across the street <laughs> okay let's see how they put the gas they put in the gas with the coca-cola okay Bomba Mica. Sí. <laughs> bueno, eso es como Bomba Mica. Listo. Hey. Esperar vuelto. Ok, he's waiting for his change. Got some, got some people doing well over here. <laughs> ok. This place is probably really busy. Um, um, during regular time. But you know we're we're dur during a new uh, way of law. But check out, they got the police station here. Okay, please stop. All right. Okay, there you go, guys. Oh, he needs gas too. El necesito. Okay, okay. There you go. Hello. Okay. Vamos, vamos. Okay. Mira el colegio de Minca. Oh. There's the college over there with the blue um, rooftop right there. And Hasul? Si. Okay. What? Okay, that's the college over there with the blue rooftop, guys. Okay. This guy's still fixing the radiator. Okay. Looks like they, everybody left us. Okay! <laughs> oh, that's actually there right there. Cuántos minutos, hermano? Eh, como dos. 25. 25 minutos. Porque está feo aquí. Son 20 minutos, pero está mucho barro. Uh -huh. So guys, he was saying it's a 20 minute ride up this way, but because it's really? it rained yeah. yesterday, it's gonna be a rough ride. Look at this. Ah, which explains why they needed a a, a bigger bike. <laughs> Ahora yo conozco porque necesito grande bo moto. Moto. Oh, all right. Oh, this is tough. Yo, like this video, man. We going through the venture for real. <laughs> yeah. Muy buena, muy buena. This is what I this is what I live for. This oh. is a venture. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, man, guys. This is it. Oh man. 
So yeah, yesterday was raining, so thank God we didn't come yesterday. Could have probably been a little bit worse. Getting up the hill, we might have had to catch mainland. Hey, what's up, what's up? Okay. Beautiful landscape though. Oh. <laughs> See if I can um, ride with you guys still. And we'll check out this whole thing. Maybe I'll make this one video. Oh. Ay, ay, ay. Get the mud, dog. Oh, man. I feel like we're like one drop away from being all muddied up. The wheels are like sliding like this. We're digging deep. Now I understand what the guy was talking about putting a bag over the um, the my bag because this is all dirtied up. So my bag is most definitely going to get dirty. Might, might not be too bad because the cargo is not that heavy, but my bag looks heavy, but it's not really. It's just a bunch of stuff I just threw in there. Man. Wear the right clothes, guys. Hey! <laughs> Por eso no hay jeep. No, no hay. Por, no puede. No, está tapado. Se tapó la vía de carretera de Minca. Ah. La está haciendo nueva. Ok. ¿Mañana? No, entre un mes. Uh. So there, there are not any jeeps available right now for one month, guys. Yeah. Uh. Feel like we're going to fall off. Any second now. Dip like that, guys. Dip like that. Hola. O por piso. ¿Estás bien? Literally, I had to put my foot down. It's muddy. It's muddy, though. It was a deep gash in there. All right. Ooh. Probably to walk this, it'll take an hour. Well, actually, probably an hour and a half, two hours walking this. Some people doing some road work. Most definitely they need to work on roads. Okay, so look, that's what they got going on. Check it out. Amigo. Okay. Oh, guys, it looks like we found some road. Oh, Gloria, yo. Oh. We found a road. <laughs> Hallelujah. All this nature is amazing. It gives me energy. Um, 
being away from any all you know smog or anything you hear the birds chirping this is what this is what it is about man and where we're going there's not going to be any wi-fi well there's going to be like a computer to use but as far as like connecting with wi-fi they don't they don't have wi-fi so i'm going to use that time to meditate more do some meditation and uh think about what i want to do with my channel the direction i want to go okay you got a police dog He said, I asked him if there's snakes here. He said, they're real big snakes here. So my mom is not into that. <laughs> Most Haitians don't like snakes anyways. Uh, I wouldn't mind seeing one for the camera. You know, like one slither right in front of us. Like a, come on, Anaconda. Come on. Anaconda. Por aquí, la montaña. Por la carretera. Por aquí. Hay, hay, Anaconda. Si. Culebra, Anaconda. Aquí, la montaña de Minca. Hay bastante en la carretera. Boa. My boy with the machete, with the machete ready to roll, just in case you gotta pull it out. See people working here, and these people live here, and the life they live is such a different lifestyle. And I can see why a lot of people like to seek these lifestyles because it's different. It's a contrast. These guys live in, and it's normal. It's no inconvenience for them. For us, you might be used to Wi-Fi signals, television. Uh, just living a certain lifestyle. Wait a minute. We slow down here. Please slow down. Sorry. Okay. It was waiting for us. Okay. That was waiting for us. Now, she said it was going to be colder. I already feel the, the, the difference in humidity here. It's really colder now. As we go higher up the, um, this uh, hill. You can probably rent your own motorcycle. But I ain't got no time for that. Alright. You probably can rent your own motorcycle, but your boy ain't got no time. Cafe. So guys, uh, I guess we're crossing a little cafe, coffee area right here. These are like coffee and arbor, arbor de cafe. So these are um, coffee trees right here. Oh, okay, it's a lot. So they have some um, coffee farms here. As we're getting, as we're moving up higher, guys, the rain is slowly drizzling down. And I can see the clouds from here, guys. Oh, yes. This is gonna be good. I hope uh, it doesn't rain so too much, though. Because uh, I got my drone. I want to fly it out. Give you guys a good perspective of where we're at. Remember, guys, like the video. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. Oh, literally, we, we are actually here. He said this is the entry. I was just gonna turn the camera off, but we're here. He said this is all coffee. Coffee right here. Rica, gratis. Free uh, coffee right here, guys. A lot of it. All that right there. There's actually several different hotels here that are super dope that are different and offer different amenities. And so, if I was you, if you can, if you're gonna be in this area for a while, you have a lot of time, bounce from different, one, try each other. Bounce from different rooms if you can. Different hotels, try one and then go to the next. I heard there's one called Hotel, like hotel Naturalesa or something like that. And it's really good, but we're going to this one because this one has a unique pool and it's pretty high up and uh basically for the pool that's what i'm going for yeah it's not bamboo no. he said it's, it looks like bamboo but it's what called woda jardinera Y también se puede hacer una puertecita de guauda, pero no dura mucho. Lo que dura eso son como unos 6 años o 7 años. Ok. Sin caerle agua, porque si le cae agua no sirve. Ok. Muy débil. So I'm going to try to translate, but he said, yeah, there's most definitely, you can use these um, trees. I thought they were bamboo, but they're not. 
Just taking it in, guys. Just taking it in. And the rain is coming down as well. Perfect use for a GoPro, though. Okay. Thank God we're actually arriving right before the rain. Looks like this is spot right here, guys. Is it? Victoria. Okay. Is it the what? The Victoria, the Museo de Café. Oh, this is like a laboratory for the cafe. La cervecería. Oh, wow. What's going on? Alright. Oh, thank God. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Gotta be careful with that rain. So this is like a place where they do the cat, uh, the coffee, process the coffee, and we are still. <laughs> oh, for me, so okay, okay. Still going up this road while it's raining. Oh man! I hope this camera can last long so you can feel it. Ah. Oh, these trees right here are giving us cover from the rain right now. Thank God. <laughs> okay, our friend is uh, left behind. I don't know what happened. Oh, okay. <laughs> he don't want to roll in the rain, so he stopped. We keep going though. I like this guy. We, we, we've been having an adventure with this guy since. <laughs> I'm cool. He wants to get to where we need to go. I ain't mad at him too. I don't know if this is it. Not it. Wow, wow, check out that. Alright guys, we are back. Okay. Oh man, it, we uh, just made it, but let me show you the entry on this place, alright? We're checking in right now, <laughs> okay? She's checking us in. Uh, the, what it is, you pay once you check out. Como está, Aco? Quiero mesa del frente. But these guys did an awesome job getting us here. Um, literally, maybe three minutes, three, four minutes after the, the video cut off, we arrive. It's still raining. But this is how you enter the place right here. And uh, yeah, it's cool. But uh, now I just want to get into the room. My room is gonna be a little costly. Mine's, I got my room for around 70 bucks. Um, reason why, because I want 70, around 75 bucks. Reason why, because it, it has a balcony and an awesome view. They're gonna be rooming, sharing rooms. And I think their rooms cost around um, 50. Hola. <laughs> All right, okay. Uh, you need my temperature. I think it's gonna be cold. <laughs> It's gonna be cold. Yeah, you're cold. <laughs> All right. So, go ahead. Come on. Let's go. Okay. I explain so it. here is the dining room. You can for every meal. Yeah. You sign in there. So for lunch before 11. But since you arrived, we can check with the kitchen. Yeah. Um. <laughs> at dinner you sign like at four, uh, but we serve at 7:30. And breakfast is between. 8 and 10. So okay. You have to sign. Those are the menus. We have coffee there, so you can have some coffee. When the man Is it there. the coffee from here? Yeah, it's from the farm. Uh, they just, uh, they just uh, fix it for us, like uh, we toasted for us a week ago. Okay. So we have like a fresh coffee every morning and everything oh. from the farm. So okay. if you want some coffee, nice. Uh, bathroom here. This side and the other side, those two down there, like in the public. On the bottom. Under it. Okay. Those okay. two bathrooms, uh, filter water here and in reception. Oh, filter water right here. Yeah, filter water. Oh, okay. Wow. They have a little rig right here, guys. And this is all natural coming from the area right yeah, here. It's from here, it's from the river, but we have a filter, a big filter, and also we purify the water for drinking and everything, so everyone will feel safe about it. Okay, this. cool. Well, as it's okay to drink from the top, but since you're not used to it, so the mm. purified water is okay. Um, okay, enjoy your round. As soon as I have the room ready, I will let you know. All right, cool. And guys, uh, you can see the, the view here. Oh, yeah. The clouds 
from here is also. Be yeah, because you can see Santa Marta down there. So afterwards, after the rain, it's gonna be Santa Marta. Nice. So. Beautiful. Nice. So this is why we came here, guys, for the view and for that infinity pool right there. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna figure it out. And uh, not bad. I need the restroom. I'll be back. <laughs> I forgot I should be filming you around, right guys? So let's go down here. This is the restroom here. All right. And she, she pointed at those restrooms there so you can wrap around and go there, but uh, I'll just use this right here. And this is uh, one of the restrooms they have here. Really nice. Ah, oh, look at that, no window. Just a little screen to hold the bugs out. And you got your toilet here. This shower here. I'm not. I'm not too sure if they have like private bathrooms, but I ain't complaining. This is cool, actually. And then close this, and I'll be back. <laughs> so, guys, on Sunday we're gonna go to their hometown, and we're gonna be eating some greasy food. <laughs> <laughs> If you haven't seen the birthday party, go watch that. If you're wondering where these guys came from, it was most likely my last video. So this is the first thing I got for the menu. I think the lunch menu is vegetarian altogether. A carrot type of vegetable soup. Actually, this is what I need right now because of the rain. <laughs> Dinner is meat, more meat, so you know I'm gonna go for the option for the meat during during dinner. Uh, we'll go for the purified, okay? Uh, I I I'm not right now I'm trying to get my stomach all uh, messed up. Oh, not bad. I want to do a little exploring on this place, and so I saw something cool here. I thought it was really really nice right here. This is awesome. You know, when you look at the website here, it doesn't show you all of this on the website. And so you might not think about coming here, but this is dope. And let me show you. We got the Mr. Cat right here, who's saying that shall not pass, <laughs> if you want to get on here. Okay, come on, cat. It's me or you. It's me or you, cat. He's not, he's not moving. All right. Okay. Let me get up on here. He ain't moving for nothing. So. Hey. Uh oh. <laughs> no say. <laughs> I feel like that thing gonna break a little bit. This <laughs> cat making it hard for me. Maybe he's telling me don't bust or something. No set. I don't want to break myself. It's with every move, this thing makes noise. Me, that's all my. Get that. It's making noise here, guys. And I got some. <laughs> oh, what's up, guys? I'm hoping. Oh. <laughs> Please don't break. I just got here. <laughs> I mean, <sighs> and the cat does not want to move for nothing. Thank you, Mr. Cat. More. Explore. Oh, wow. This is the bar area. And the bar starts in um, 30 minutes from now. It's at 2, two o'clock, 2 to 10. And you got $3 Coca-Cola. Happy Coca, Happy Tucan. These are like draft beers and stuff you can get. So this is the entry into the pool area right here, guys. Let's see. All right, let's go in there. Okay. Hola. Okay. All right. Nice scenery. This is the bathrooms we saw from up there. <laughs> Hang it out. And man, oh man. Like, 
This is like your changing area or a shower area. And I love it. I love it. Literally, you can come in here and literally just be shower in the wilderness. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, shower this way and shower that way, Thank man. You? Oh my gosh. And then this is what I came here for. So it says no shoes on deck. And just a little shower here. And man, this is exactly what I came for. This right here. And it's a deep, really deep. <laughs> wow. And um, I don't know if you heard what the lady was saying earlier. You can actually, like when it's like clear skies, you can actually see the city from here. And I can actually see the silhouettes of it. You know, this camera girl, she's, <laughs> she wanna make sure she get it right. You're gonna tell us how I told her to look into there because she's short. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> no, no, <way. laughs> she, she, she's exaggerating, bro. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Wow. Wow. Qué lindo. Vamos a aprender a Dale, 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 dale. Check your rooms out. Okay. Welcome to my room. <laughs> it has its own private <laughs> bathroom. Oh, this is nice. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. Very nice. Okay. okay. And they got a fan. Okay, let's go look for my room. All right. We're going further back down to the cliff area. Be careful here. Okay. Because yeah, the rocks are kind of slippery. Okay. Where are you from? I'm uh, from the coffee area here in Colombia. In Armenia. Manizales. 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 Manizales, okay. Yes. All right. It looks like kind of like around here. So you like being around coffee? Yeah, basically. I, like, I like the cold uh, temperature. I don't like the heat too much. Oh, you, so you you enjoy Bogota? I love Bogota. <laughs> I live in Bogota 12 years. Ah, uh, okay. All right, guys. So it stopped raining, so I'm going to be doing the, the pool. Can't wait. Nice. Right. Okay. Wow. This is a huge room. It is. Uh huh. I'm gonna leave your key here. Is the bed comfy? It's super comfy. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, your key there. All right. Be careful with your key because I think it's the last one I have. Okay. I have to make some coffee. Okay, all right, thank you. And then, got a nice roof, tall roof. You only get here for one day, guys. Oh, man. Guys, check this out. This being outside of this porch. Really, sometimes you reflect, just think. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now, check this out right here. The bathroom. <laughs> GQ up in here, man. GQ. <laughs> oh, exactly what I needed. Okay. Exactly what I needed. And then they have a thing right here. Um, I don't know what this is. Get a velo, hey! Oh, hey, Mia! Wow, Mia! Amazing! Cafe, cafe. Uh huh. <laughs> Relax it, man. Relax. <laughs> Oh man, it's good, it's good, man, it's good. Okay. 
All right, guys. So, the ladies is doing her her model thing. You, if you haven't followed her on IG, make sure you go follow her. She does a lot of pictures. All right. So we are here. <laughs> okay. Oh, it feels so good. Uh, it's not that deep. It's like probably five feet. Uh, it's really good. Gracias. <laughs> the best time to get in this pool is like mid afternoon or around 11 o'clock when the sun is out and it's beaming here because we are so high in there you can literally sometimes see the clouds and it kind of is chilly i wish this was a little bit warmed up but i can't complain this is what i got to look at man it's really good so i wanted to talk about the wi-fi here right if you have teagle let's say you travel here just get um, one of the local plans here teagle or for me i have mobile x exito and you get a signal here all right They have a gift for me. I don't know what the hell the gift is, but they want to give me a gift. And I asked her what it is, she didn't want to tell me, so we're going to figure it out, okay? It's this dark night, enjoying the time. Make sure that has it, bro. Oh, like, I didn't even expect that, man. I was not. What's up guys, it's the next day. Um, I'm not too sure if this video is gonna be part of the first or two, or part two, but uh, I'm loving this place right now. Uh, just looking at the scenery gives you so much energy. And then this pool right here, oh man, I had so much fun in this pool. Um, I gotta check out today, but <laughs> I just wanted to show you how this place look in the daytime, all right? Oh, look at that. An infinity pool. You can't beat that, man. Literally, if you look at the website of this place I'm at, they don't even show you all of this, but it's, it's well worth coming to. All right, I did a little bit of walking today because when we arrived here, it was raining, it was dark, and I thought I'd re-record re the entry so you guys can see how it looks and do a little bit of walking around inside the road just to give you the vibes. I really want you to get excited about coming to these type of events. So let's do it. Okay. Move up. Look at that guys, look at that. <laughs> man, when you come to certain countries, man, 
don't just book a hotel look for places like this if you can plan your trip all right if you're enjoying this long video or if this is a second video just give it a like if would really appreciate that okay let's go to the front i'm talking too much that's what i'm I like <laughs> i'll wind it hmm Yes, now you can see the front a little bit better without the rain. Motorcycles. Those big trees that are not bamboo, supposedly. That's what the guy said. Looks like bamboo cousins, if anything. And... There it is, the entry into this place. Feels like bamboo. <laughs> but they're real thick. So I've seen bamboo when I was in Vietnam and they use the bamboo to make boats. So if you haven't seen that video, Vietnam boat maker, Check that out it's on my channel and um it was similar but they were a little bit smaller these are a little bit more thicker i don't know if bamboo grows looks a hole here looks like maybe some animal created a hole and let's move down a little bit longer i like these type of things i, I like <laughs> going and seeing the unknown you know what I mean? I enjoy these walks. And this is uh, this road right here. Granted, it's artificial because they they made it, but it it excites me. We got some water coming out from here. Hold this camera up straight. Camera likes to act up when there's no light. Wow. And um, I heard something over here. Yo, the noise freaked me out, yo. something right over there like a ticking noise all this water is just leading into the air drenching now I keep looking back to see if something about to pull up on me time to get back man <laughs> I'm an explorer but time to get back they, you can see some coffee uh, trees right here yeah interesting th thing to note um about this place they they have horseback riding if you want that they also have a private waterfall you can go to it's a three-hour walk to it um i decided i'm not gonna do that but for those who want to enjoy that eco um friendly or this a uh, uh, hike here uh three hour hike and then they'll bring you to uh, like a car a coffee farm and stuff like that if you want to do that it's available this, pl this place is like a perfect place to get in tune with nature and you, if you want a place that's quiet and just chill, this place is like that. But I hear this place can get a little bit busy during the weekends, especially during holidays. A lot of Colombians will come over here for the holidays and enjoy their time. So it's a cool place to go to. I'm going to check into a new hotel today. The reason why I'm going to the new place is because instead of a three hour walk, it's a 15 minute walk to a waterfall. They're a private waterfall. They have a lot of waterfalls here. So I decided I'll do that. Plus it has Wi-Fi, stronger signals over there. So for me and um, keeping in touch with you guys, it'll be more important. But anyways, guys, 
would you stay at this place comment down below comment down below would you stay at this place don't leave it in the live chat comment down below what was your favorite part about this video um in the comments i'm gonna be looking especially for your comments all right really appreciate the participation anyways guys see you in the next video i'm filming today <laughs> okay can't wait to show you the new spot yo thanks man Pre really appreciate it man thanks for watching this long video <laughs> all right time to go i think i'm gonna jump in the pool before i leave though yeah, we're gonna jump in the pool. Let's jump in the pool. <laughs> yeah.